Go ahead. The best view we got was through the uh, binoculars, and um, the best way I can describe it is uh, there's some kind of um, reflective uh, cloth or um, with uh, some, some metallic-looking type of cloth uh, of a structure that's uh, definitely not rigid or uh, it's not a, um, a you know solid metal structure. It started over uh, window eight, uh, then quickly uh, moved towards the nose of the orbiter, um, and we tracked it through windows uh, one, two, three, four, and uh, now it's out. What about window five? Can you get a uh, still imagery if you can and any estimate on size or range? <laughs> believe in life on other planets uh, oh yes there's not much question at all but there's life throughout the universe we're not alone in the universe at all you convinced that we're not alone in the universe oh i know for sure we're not alone in the universe and uh, i happen to be privileged enough to have uh, be in on the fact that we have been visited on this planet and the ufo phenomenon is real although it's been covered up by our governments for quite a long time it is a real phenomenon and uh, there's quite a few of us. There's, it's been well covered up by all of our governments uh, for the last 60 years or so. Uh, but slowly it's leaked out. And some of us are privileged to have been briefed on some of it. 
but I've also been in military circles and intelligence circles that knows beneath the surface of what has been uh, public knowledge that, yes, we have been distant. But I have been deeply involved in certain committees and certain research programs with very credible scientists and very uh, intelligence people that uh, do know the real inside story, and I, I am not uh, hesitant to talk about it. There's been quite a few, there's quite a bit of contact going on. We have been visited. The Roswell crash was real, and a uh, number of other contacts have been real and ongoing. Uh, it's pretty well known for, for, to those of us who have um, been briefed and have been close to the subject matter. And that there's UFOs in the skies all the time that are very likely alien craft. Now, not all of them are. I suspect some of them are homegrown. I suspect that in the last 60 years or so that there has been some uh, back engineering and the creation of this type of equipment, but it's not nearly as sophisticated as, yet as uh, what the apparent visitors have. An object which is at the same place all the time but appears to be tumbling. Well, we've had it ever since yesterday. It just seems to be tagging along with us. Uh, we do see that. Okay. That's uh, looking out in front of the orbiter. Okay, we're seeing three or four objects. Uh, can, you, can you confirm that it's just the one that's actually moving and the other ones are just reflect, reflections? No, there are, uh, there are three objects. The one you see, you see two rings right there. They're the ones we kind of had the late tally-ho on. Uh, the one uh, down the bottom, that was the one we initially saw. We have an unidentified flying object.